games like this, it's what Saturday night is all about. Good evening, everybody. This is Dave Renner alongside Gary Gavin. Both teams starting the top rise, and here come the Habs. Hit over the line, Gallagher with a shot, and it rises over the shoulder of Hutchinson. Sharp angle drive, it's knocked down, goes into the corner. Have that kind of rhythm, they just walk into your zone, they get some offensive zone time. Riley off the faceoff win, another stop made by Hutchinson. Out front, they score! Brendan Gallagher opens the scoring tonight. It's 1-0 Canadians. To get themselves a goal, and he's going to get a goal that's just one you've seen him do so many times. He battles out. Look at the numbers of the Leafs. You've got two Maple Leaf players that are standing right in the crease. You've got CeCe and Timoshev. He walks, he rolls off CeCe, walks in between him and Timoshev. Weber reaching for it. Here's Kerfoot now out in front, and he kind of handcuffed McCabe. He gets it right back. McCabe, his backhander was a little soft. Here comes Jonathan Drua in. Scores! Shooting area, and then Mikhaev turns his puck over to Armia, who backhand saucers it right up to Drouin. Forehand, backhand deke. He goes back through the five hole, and it's the right leg of Hutchinson that drags the puck across the goal line. Watch that right leg as he banks it in off it. He takes it right over to the post. The referee had his hands pointing right at it. You can see it kind of dribble its way across the line right there. Well, one team played last night. And you know that the Maple Leafs are going to be a little tired, more than the Canadians. Here's a chance in front. Marner dishes off. Save. They score. The one-timer by Muzzin. A huge goal for the Leafs. I would say this one is equally as important. He comes off the blue line. His timing is impeccable. As he knows when you have a guy like Marner, who is such an adept passer, that if you time it right, he will find you. And the one thing that Muzzin did that he had to do was he couldn't dust this puck off. He There's Muzzin. Muzzin drops it back. Little give and go. Steps in. Backhander. Price the save. Rebound. And they almost found it in behind Price. Buck stays in. One off the stick of Leckin. And Toronto steps back in. Matthews back and forth with Nylander. Nylander. Too far ahead of Riley, back in front, loose puck, Price down, they scramble and score! Turnover in the neutral zone by Lekkinen, he can't handle the puck, the Maple Leafs come in, they've got the numbers at the net, and Janssen eventually gets it off his skate and slides it. Big goal last night, that helps them get back into that game late in the second, and then tonight, Late in the first, he buries one with 16 seconds, has a couple other good chances. Here's a chance right now, Armia scores! He's gonna get walked here by Joel Armia. He reaches for a puck instead of getting body position. And look at him put a stick on his head. He knows, that's not the way I play. You can't be reaching with your stick. A big, strong guy like Armia, who I think has been one of the more consistent Montreal Canadiens since the start of the year, the big, strong frame. He's just starting to feel it. As a month. Mitch Marner looking around, dishes off. Up top for Barry, lost the handle, and here comes Drouin. Jonathan Drouin back in, scores! back and again drew in the middle of the ice picks the puck off of Barry and when he was going in I thought is he Cabinet trying to get it around Cousins cannot and Montreal comes away with Thompson leading the way in front they score Nick Suzuki Cabinet doesn't get it in deep Muzzin's already down low because you're down a couple of goals, you're taking some risks, and that allows Nate Thompson to pick it. And it's going to be another win on a Saturday night for Carey Price as everybody rises and salutes their Canadians as they take out the Toronto Maple Leafs tonight. 5-2 final.